everybody, welcome to Dakman Productions and welcome to Conahay Southern, my HO layout. Uh, for those who are fans of Dakman Productions, if you missed it, I did start uh, dabbling into HO a little bit. And no, I did not give up on O Gage. <laughs> so and I'm, I'm going to keep mentioning that so people don't think I abandoned O Gage, which I didn't. So my focus on Conahay Southern for HO is modern day today's trains and locomotives and rolling stock because uh, i believe that um ho is a lot more accurate when it comes to that and there's a lot more choices in today's modern rolling stock and locomotives in ho than there is in o gauge um so i've had a couple fans who've already asked me uh, questions on my HO layout that I started, um, which is currently four by eight. I am going to expand on that here shortly this year. But, um, so the question was, what locomotives do I run? Or what ones did I pick out? So I picked out two brand names of locomotives uh, with the help of Sterling Ravenhawk, and he knows that I have high expectations for quality and and details and stuff like that. So the two locomotive brands that I run are Scale Trains and Atherm Genesis. So today I'm going to focus on Scale Trains. Now the Scale Trains locomotives, in my opinion, bar none have the best details uh, of any HR locomotive that I've seen so far. That includes the Atherm Genesis, the Atlas uh, Gold Series. They, they have a ton of detail. Uh, the lighting features on them are great. Uh, they come with lock sound, ESU lock sounds in them. They're just a, a overall. They're they're just well detailed, and I mean they're a little bit more expensive than many other HO locomotives out there. But you got to remember the the amount of details that they uh, come with is uh, it's 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 overwhelming uh, how well detailed they are. Um, so if you're looking for locomotives that are really well detailed, in my opinion. Uh, look at scale trains. So let's take a look at the fleet of scale trains that I do have. So we have this CSX ES44AH. And then we go along into the CSX Pride and Service locomotives, which are all ES44ACs. And uh, I really like these units. And... I had these in O gauge at one time and I sold them all off. Uh, the main disappointment was that Lionel had advertised the CSX Pride and Service Police Enforcement Locomotive with the blue and the red ditch light. And instead it came with clear ones. So to me it wasn't advertised. It didn't arrive as advertised. Uh, not to mention that Lionel forgot graphics on two out of the three and then didn't even get the paint job correct on a, the military one. But Scale Trains did offer the law enforcement one with the blue and red ditch lights. Let's check it out real quick. So I finally got the locomotive I've always wanted. I just had to go into HO to get it, unfortunately. But uh, I just find that the uh, the Scale Trains product is pretty cool.
Okay, up for the next ones, we have uh, an ET44AH, and then an AC4400, and then another ES44AC, which is actually a Norfolk Southern Heritage Unit. I do have the Scale Train CSX Conroe Heritage Unit on pre-order as well. And lastly, I have the Scale Trains CSX SD40-3. Those were CSX uh, rebuilds, and they used those for switchers, which is what I'm going to do here in my facility uh, for the grain service. I'm going to use it for switching. So far, my adventure into HO has been pretty uh, exciting, and uh, I've been having fun with it, definitely uh in the build of the stuff as well uh, people who saw the layout and pictures and the video uh were pretty impressed by the build and it's not perfect by any means but i do plan on adding another four by eight section this way i know i've said that before but looking forward to that and for a uh, four by eight layout i have four facilities that i can deliver to and i think that's pretty cool to have that much place that many places to deliver to in a little four by eight area um but uh thank you very much for watching this video uh if you like the uh ho side of uh dac man productions don't forget to leave comments because i don't know unless i get feedback uh people have noticed the last four or five train shows that i haven't shot anything really in HO that much and so I do plan on going back to that when I go back to to the great scale train show in Timonium which is mostly an HO video or HO train show there are a gauge there uh, I will start to focus back on bringing the HO videos to you guys so make sure you look out for them if you like HO uh, just make sure you watch for upcoming videos because uh, I judge things on by views, and so if I don't see the videos getting a lot of views, then I tend have a tendency to, to stay away from it and do something else. So I hope you guys enjoyed this edition of Conahay Southern HO, and uh, looking forward to uh, bringing you guys more HO content in the future. won't be as often as O-Gage, but I still will bring it to you time to time again uh you'll notice that i haven't focused on a lot of ho in the last three or four shows because the shows were so crowded it slowed me down but when i get back to the great scale train show i'll bring you guys uh more ho footage but uh hope you enjoyed this hope you enjoyed the run and we'll catch you guys trackside goodbye